Here is the 3 1. Grip and Masterman drives this one. That will get to the wall. Jordan will be rounded third. Masterman goes the second. Throw coming in. Will not be in time. It is an RBI double for Cam Masterman. Right on cue there. The pitch. Jenkins drives this one to the gap. That is going to get down. Around third is Masterman. Jenkins will head to second. The throw coming in from left field will not go in time. And now back-to-back -back RBI doubles for the Westerners. Jenkins brings brings in Masterman. 2 nothing, Danbury. But if they win the wild card, it will really solidify that. A 2-2. Two -two. Grounded third baseline down by Gursky. Around third is Jenkins. That one's headed towards the bullpen. Gursky's going to second. He's going to hold up there in second. It's an RBI double for Will Gursky. And the Westerners are up 3 nothing. Go to. Runner goes. Peyton grounds it. Gets through the hole and a run will score. It takes a high hop over to Flint. Gursky gets the second. Danbury now has a 4-3 to three lead. Once again, an RBI single by Jack Payton. Here's the pitch. Masterman flies this one deep, but it is going to be deep enough for Brendan Cumming. And now Jordan's going to run. The throw from Cumming is going to be offline, and it's going to be a sack fly for Cam Masterman. And Danbury is up 5-4. to four. Another one. There's one out. There's one out. This one gets behind the catcher. Kopak coming home is Murillo. And it is a 6-4 Westerners lead on a wild pitch. Down, they're 0-8 on the season. That is a wild stat as that one gets through, and that's going to get down. Coming home is Griffith. Masterman will be rounding first, but he'll get back. It's an RBI single, his third of the night for Kim Masterman. And it is now a three-run game, 7-4 Dan Mary. Looking to fight themselves back. Runner going, swung at, at to second. Griffith gets it, fires over to Gr Jenkins. For the third out, the Danbury Westerners take game number one here at the shipyard. A score of seven to four.